G'day, James Cullen from Stones Corner Marine, and today I get the opportunity to show you over a Bar Crusher 670 XT. Now, the XT is the latest model in the Bar Crusher range of center consoles. It's been out for a number of years now, and it's a really aesthetically smart looking boat with a fixed T top structure and nice hard top roof. We'll get a look at that as we walk around the boat. But in the meantime, I just want to say this boat is loaded with options. Stay with me, it will be a long video, but I want to show you as much as I can in the, in the short minutes that I have for you. So I'm just going to start. The Bar Crusher 670 XT here is pictured on the factory Easy Tow Bar Crusher trailer. However, this trailer does have some upgraded features, including the Northern Territory upgrade, which just reinforces and strengthens different parts of the trailer. It includes 15 inch wheels, opposed to the standard 13 or 14 inch options. It also includes features such as the swingway drawbar. So just, we'll just take a quick look. We've got the swingway, swingway beach draw, drawbar here. So this comes around here and will extend the tow uh, point by this distance here. So that's basically, let's call it 175 um, centimeters. So it just gives you a bit more length when you're launching those trickier conditions. Okay, you'll see here we've got the factory bar crusher um, stone guard, and that is a deflector stone guard, but shape and style to suit the bar crusher 670 hull. So that's not an out of the box solution. It's one for the factory, made by deflector. It's a quality product. Zip out there to clean and access the boat, etc. Now remember these easy tow trailers in themselves are a, a high quality um, trailer fitted with quality gear from the foot and winch, the knot jockey wheel, uh, and the Hydro Pro braking unit, okay? So quality gear on a quality trailer. While we're on the side of the boat, actually, we'll just point out, we've got the Minn Kota Tarova. Um, that Minn Kota there is one of the most popular models we see, uh, and I'm sure on this boat, whether it be offshore, on an impoundment, or up a big river system, that's gonna get plenty of use on this boat. All right. While we're walking around, we'll just say that that, that Minn Kota also is, is powered by the BLA lithium battery. So it's a 24 volt, 50 amp lithium battery, uh, and they're available through our dealership. Customers taking all options here. We also have the stress-free anchor winch. Now we've been dealing in stress-free anchor winches for over 20 years, and they're a high quality Australian made product. Partnered with the electric motor, we've got all anchoring uh, options uh, considered uh, and factored in, in the use of this boat. A lot of gear on this boat. All right, let's have a look at the styling of this roof. So this is the XT roof. So you'll see that the, the fixed hard top it is a fixed structure. It's bolted to the console. It's not the folding design that we see in the WR range. You'll see with that uh, fixture, we're able to get a, a longer shade area. And we've also got things such as uh, a cockpit light up underneath. We've got rod storage. And at the rear, we've got a couple of spots coming off the back. Uh, looking at the front, if I can get up there, yeah, and we've also got a light bar across the front. Aerials on top, including the uh, Garmin GPS aerial, but also the um, uh, heading sensor for Yamaha. Because this boat is fitted with a Hellmaster autopilot system. It's the stage two system, okay? It doesn't have the full maneuverability kit. We've got the um, electric motor for that. That's the stage two, which includes the autopilot for those long runs. We'll have a look at that uh, control panel on the dash in a minute. Okay, moving around the boat, you can see a couple of uh, deluxe uh, helm seats there. They're the bolster seats. Nice support, we'll have a quick look when we get in. We've got the deluxe bait board. That's a fixed bait board, includes a couple of drawers, quality gear. There's a quality all around this boat. Have a look at this. This is the Yamaha 200 horsepower uh, outboard, and it includes the electric steering. It's painted in the pearlescence white. It's got the highly polished Reliance stainless steel propeller on it, and it's all digital control, okay? So we'll get up and have a look at that in a minute. I think this classic white boat, set off with this pearlescence white Yamaha, looks bloody sweet. All right, um, at the transom here, trim tabs have been fitted. So just under here, we'll have a look here. We've got trim tabs fitted. Trim tabs give the uh, side leveling control uh, at the helm. Uh, I certainly recommend them on these big center consoles with the deep Vs. Just gives the, me more control at the helm when I'm driving, just to level out that boat. We've got a couple of ocean LED underwater lights fitted also, uh, and they're high quality gear. Certainly recommend if you're looking for underwater lights, don't look past ocean LED quality, quality kit. 
We've got Garmin transducer on the back here, and let's get up and have a look at the dash. We'll have a look at a couple of big Garmin's. All right, have a look at this dash. We, we, we really pride ourselves at Stones Corner Marine and putting together quality dash layouts. And we work with our clients here to achieve the best outcome with the equipment they want, with the space we've got to work. So this dash here uh, has been fitted with two Garmin 8412 XSB units. They've been paired together and share information. And, and beneath that, we have the Yamaha um, CL5 gauge the Yamaha Hellmaster Autopilot Control Panel. We have the stress-free control panel and circuit breaker. And we have the trim tab control. Okay, so they're electric tab, trim tab. I'll show you them down the back. High quality gear. Basically here, we have got all the control mechanisms to the, to the right of the wheel. We've got the digital control. We've got the ignition. We've got the trim tabs. So easy off when you're, when you're driving the boat, easy from the throttle, adjust the trim tabs and back to the throttle. You're not having to take your eyes far from where you're looking and your hand isn't traveling too far either. Big, large dash, cup holders up the top here, places to put your remote for your uh, electric motor, etc. And plenty of height. I stand at six foot, I stand at six foot and there is plenty of height under here for you tall lads out there. All right, we've got a fusion uh, stereo system in this boat. Um, I will have a look at that model. I think it is one of the Apollo Rangers, and, and that's fitted with an amp and four signature series speakers. Okay, so an amp and four signature series speakers. Let me tell you, it's not short of a tune, this boat. I'm sure with some quality uh, music selections, the rest of the bay is gonna hear it as you cruise across it. All right, in regards to the rest of this dash, plenty of handles around the T-top structure and the dash. We've got the electric steering from Yamaha fitted. We've got the usual switch panels and plenty of blank switches uh, positions available in the event that you want to upgrade or add more equipment. Okay, we've got the delete, deluxe uh, rear seat box. As I said, the two big bolster seats are mounted on top of that. There's plenty of room under that for an esky. So the esky isn't taking up this rear fishing room. You can get slid up and under uh, the helmet navigator seats. Let's go to the front of the boat. We'll have a quick look up here in regards to the cast deck uh, and hatches. All right, so we'll see firstly, look at these Fusion Signature Series speakers. Four of them putting plenty of noise back into the boat, back to the center and toward the aft. Um, as I said, you gotta hear this boat to believe how good it is. All right, got a good size cast deck, plenty of room for two people to be fair. You know, if you've got two people, one, one casting backhand or left hand, and one casting right here. There's plenty of room for two people to fish uh, with a bit of experience. There's nice rails around this T-top. I'll just point out while I'm standing here. Very nice, so, so you know, as you're stepping off and onto the cast platform, there is somewhere that just assists there, uh, keeping you stable on your feet. A couple of drink holders uh, on each side here. Um, they, they can certainly be used, whether it's for a drink or throwing spent lures, jig heads, wasted plastics, etc. As I said, we talked about the stress-free winch. We've got the big Sarka anchor out the front for plenty of holding. A couple of tie-off points here for different other ropes, etc. Um, but all in all, you know, this, this boat is set to fish. Let's have a look under here. Look at that. How nice is it to have a hatch in the marine industry with gas struts? There's stainless steel gas struts, uh, and they hold that lid up and prevent it from falling on my hands or on my head when I'm getting gear out. You'll see neatly placed uh, in the boat is that uh, lithium battery. Believe it or not, that battery weighs about 14 kilograms. Battery power's come a long way uh, with good capacity. There are Bluetooth um, management system in that battery, and that can all be checked on your phone and monitored throughout the day and over the course of your fishing adventure. Plenty of room in around that area to store. Um, I don't believe there's um, any lack of storage in this boat. I'll put that back down. Just a note, lockable, lockable latch on this front cast platform. That certainly comes in handy for those um, weekends away, etc. Uh, good access here into the console. Keep in mind, we're gonna fit a lot of things in these consoles, but you also need access to things like fuses. So this nice panel here opens down, gives you nice access on the water to troubleshoot with fuses, etc. if you have one of your components go down. 
Look, I think that's about it in regards to the uh, the standout features, etc. Huge electronics, all paired together. Autopilot, electric motor, electric winch, amazing sound system, dual batteries, deluxe baits, deluxe bait boards, digitally controlled outboards. And th this is the bomb when it comes to packages. Thank you very much for watching this video. And if you'd like any more information or a package done up, certainly give uh, Glenn, Cliff or Troy uh, a call at the dealership on 3397 9766 and we'll be sure to package up a deal for you. We won't be publicising any package price of what this boat sold for publicly. We always keep that uh, respectful for the new owner. Cheers for watching.